Hey, what is going on, YouTubers? Welcome to my channel. I'm Ian Higton, and I'm here to play some Deathloop. Yeah, that's right. Welcome, everyone. Um, I am indeed Ian Higton, and I am indeed here to play some Deathloop, a game of what I completed last night, and I very much enjoyed. So I'm looking forward to trying it out again. Now I know what the hell I'm doing. Uh, apologies for my hair, by the way. I'm about an hour or so out of uh, recording a VR corner uh, for Sunday. So I've got VR hair. Uh, what little hair I've got left. Uh, <laughs> um, VR corner this Sunday is... Uh, I, I ended up playing the Mafia Definitive Edition VR mod. And uh, I had a very good time. And you could check that out on Eurogames YouTube channel. On Sunday, but today it's this. Now, I've already streamed the first four hours of this game on Eurogamer, but I was a bit slow and a bit unsteady on my feet, so I took a little bit of a, uh, a while to get used to things. And also, uh, there's a lot of different things you can do in this game, so I'll be taking some different routes as I go through. So it won't be ultra-identical to my Eurogamer stream. And in fact, I'll probably... Um, I feel like I know this game quite well now, so... Um, I, I feel like I might um, might get through a lot of it quite quickly. Uh, but we'll see, we'll see. Hope everyone is well anyway. Who's joining so far? Oops, I pressed the wrong button. What have I done? We've got Claire T-Rex, Dom Walker, Kate Lily, Nightcat, Nyemphilar, Inspired Zombie, Dragon Botherer. Thomas Kremaskoli, Steve365, Wolpers Obscura, when I'm 64 bits, currently chatting on the YouTubes, Nightcat, Belgareth, Twin Garage, and Dragon Bother are over on the Twitch shows as well. So welcome all. Uh, let's get this show on the road and let's protect the loop. I might try, uh, let's break the loop even. I might try to protect the loop at some point. Um, but to be honest with you, it doesn't work very well. Um, the matchmaking takes bloody ages. Uh, and I've only, it takes so long that I've only ever been able to get into two, uh, two games. The first one I did, I got into it and the person playing as Colt immediately disconnected. Prick. And the second time I got in and it was quite cool. I was in someone's game for half an hour and they were like really hiding and I was, it was a proper hunt. Uh, in the end I killed them three times though. Um, I killed them the first time I killed them, their body got left behind, and it's a bit like Dark Souls, all the stuff you've collected, or you're like, it's called Residuum or whatever in this game. Actually, I'm going to call it Residium because someone like complained that I called it Residium. Residium. So uh, I'm spiteful like that. Uh, yeah, they left all their Residium on the floor, and they needed to get that to get out and make their time worthwhile in that level. So I just camped it and then ended, in the end ended up killing them and lost everything anyway. Ha 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 ha. They must have been raging. Um, what I am going to do is when it becomes available, I will stick this on to open. Um, so I'll be invaded by actual real life people playing as Juliana at some point during my playthrough. In my original playthrough, um, I, wanted, I needed to do some capturing and stuff, and real-life Juliana's popped in occasionally and absolutely whooped me. And I didn't like that, so I put it on um, AI. Like, and um, that, It's a lot easier fighting AI Juliana than it is real-life Juliana. But, uh, anyway, thoughts on Deathloop? Now you finished it, says Volpers Obscura. I loved it. Um, it's not as open and um, free as I thought it would be, but saying any more than that would be a bit of a spoiler. Um, the AI is terrible. Um, apart from that, I think it's great. Yeah. Can't you just hurry up already? Hi, Nightcat. Hope you well after stabbing yourself with loads of. Was it sewing needles? That's not good. That's quite a lot of uh, quite a lot of stabbing going on there. Hey, Gavin. That was why. Joaquin Velasquez says, I can actually watch the stream because I tore my oh, meniscus and have to stab my butt till I get better. Oh. Yay. Well, welcome, Joaquin. Oh. And uh, I hope your meniscus gets better. Oh. I have no idea what a meniscus is, so um, hopefully it's not too painful. Is it worth getting? I'd say it's definitely worth getting on PlayStation 5. I've heard there's a lot of issues with the PC version. Um, so you may want to wait for some updates for the PC version. 
Uh, but yeah, the PS5 version nope. is uh, it's pretty good, actually. Oh, man. So I'm currently playing on the performance mode, Ooh. which Who gives you 60 you? frames Ooh, per my second. Name. My name. Um, Son of a fuck! Actually, hold on. I didn't show this off on the Eurogamer stream, but I found it out after um, in the visuals menu. There's performance mode, which is 4K scaling, performance prioritized, no ray tracing, steady 60 frames per second. I actually played it on the ray tracing mode for uh, quite a bit um, when I was playing it on my own. And the 30 frames per second isn't great. It do, After playing in 60 frames per second, you really notice the 30 frames per second. But the with the ray tracing enabled and the high graphics fidelity done, all the scenery and everything looks great. Uh, in performance mode, it does look a little bit washed out on the PlayStation. Um, but I don't think the ray tracing even works properly on the PC. Why do I know this? Oh, okay. The PC version is rubbish, says Gavin. I'm putting up with it, but I wish I got it for PS5. Apart from that one bit in um, my stream for Eurogame where the game like lagged it, it kind of like just paused for like 30 seconds for like no discernible reason um, apart from that one time it's worked really well for me there's been a few asset oh, flickerings great. here and there but um, no I've I've okay. um, had no problems with it apart from that this place is mine shiny shiny yeah, makes me feel funny Okay, so let's just grab all the bits and bobs. <coughs> Story-wise, at the start at least, I'm not going to pay too much Must attention to the story because I did this for Eurogamer, uh, this, all this intro bit. So I'm going to just kind of get through this as quick as I can. Um, when I did it for Eurogamer, I was like trying to stealth my way through and stuff. And took a little while, but you can get through this I'm prologue pretty quick if you... Uh, if you can be bothered. One. Yeah, four, five, one. Yeah. Maybe I should go look for this code. Colt! Hey, is my name Colt? That's got My name's Colt. I don't feel like a Colt. You don't look like a Colt either. So freezing cold water hurts. If you didn't know about that, it certainly does. Already got full ammo. Oh, I've... Shit. I didn't That's pick up my knife. Perfect. Oh, is it up here? I think my knife might be up here, actually. Eon. There's my knife. Yeah, that doesn't sound good. So, one of the things I've uh, very much enjoyed doing in this game is um, utilizing... It's, um, he's having a hands-free wee-wee, which is pretty cool. Um, I'm going to utilize the kick mechanic. Boink! Sploosh. Uh, instead of stabbing him up. I've done this before, haven't I? Nope, I'm good. So even on performance mode, though, it does look, uh, it generally looks very, uh, very pretty. Uh-huh, uh-huh. So it was up here. I took quite a while getting to this point <laughs> in the in the Eurogamer stream. But it was just up here. I died for the first time and had to, like, run through it all again. I'm going to try not to die this time. I feel like I'm a little bit better now. Although I don't have any of the skills I had before, which is, um, is a shame. All my slabs and everything are gone now. All my cool trinkets and weapons that I'd collected. So I'm going to need to... Um, re all the good stuff and um, I've got like a, a combination of uh, slabs and powers that I really like <laughs> are we doing PUBG this week if so there's a bit of a chunky update to be done says Dreadpool Oh, uh, yes, PUBG this week. I've not asked the sausages, so I don't know who's joining. I'll definitely be there, though. There's no new Game Plus in this, Kate Lily, um, but... Uh, oh, shit, whoop. There's no new Game Plus, but you can keep playing 
with all your powers and stuff and doing the loop over and over okay. again to uh, unlock everything hello, you need. Uh, hello? I, uh... Okay, look, I don't know what I did last night exactly, but if you could just, uh... Uh... I think we know each other. We know each other, don't we? Oh, hold on. Um, you want to be able to hear Juliana as well. So this is another thing that I um, I realized after the Eurogame the stream. Uh, instead of holding the controller up to my my head, my microphone, you should be able to hear it like this now. Well, it's a little hazy. How much do you remember? My name's Colt. You want to kill me for some reason, and I already know some fucking code, which I don't, and there's this You loop wanna thing. break the loop, right? Uh, yeah, I think so. Uh, look, if you don't try to break the loop, I'm just going to kill you over and over again in increasingly violent ways until you die. Fine, I'll break your fucking loop, and whatever I did to piss you off, I'm sorry. Uh, still there? You never said that before. We dated, didn't we? Just go inside the library. You need to see this. Okay, let's keep going. Here's the library. Right. I'm in the library. Whatever you do, don't pull the lever. I'm gonna pull the lever. Hello. Gets this point took me about an hour in the oh, game or uh, what? stream. Uh, you want me to put the volume up a bit? Oh, you always fall for the same old shit. Just once, please. Can you try? Try your hardest to make this interesting. Whoa. What the fuck is this? Carnesis! Uh, You're gonna uh, give me that attitude? Uh, you know, I usually uh, make it easy uh, for you, you ungrateful uh, prick. But... Uh, this time I'll let you see yourself out. Hopefully that'll be a little bit better. Uh, why are you doing this? Uh, what did I do to you? <laughs> yeah, I love the voiceovers in this. I think they're well no. good and shit. The ah! Okay, I need to jump. Okay. Yeah! Oh. Whoa! Uh, you, you gotta be shitting me! Are you listening to me? You wrote it on Black Reef. You already know the code. What the fuck does that mean? Hello? Are you dead yet? Uh, what? I'm ready. Pull me up! Man, you're a postcard, dumbass! You wrote it on the Black Reef postcard! You understand? Okay. I'm gonna drive you now. Wait, no, wait! What the fuck? No, no! And that was your first day on Black Reef. Ah, <laughs> 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 just dropped myself. What kind of fucked up world is this? <laughs> okay, postcard, postcard. Get the postcard, get off this beach. So there's a huge amount of dialogue, um, especially between Colt and Juliana, and each time you start a loop or Same uh, enter a new area, Same fucking radio you get a little bit of back and forth between them, and generally it's always quite amusing and uh, pretty well written, I think. Um, there are some great characters I like. Okay, we've got the code is on the back of the postcard this time. Should have looked at it. First time. You gotta be kidding but me. I didn't. Okay, so this is a different different All code right. from last time because they randomized the codes. I have a code uh, and an address in Updine. Oh damn. Never, ever going to break the loop. It's absolutely impossible. You it's want not possible. me to break it? You don't want this me to break it. This guy's done it. You want from me? I want you to not suck. Okay, it's been a pretty shitty morning. Or two, so I'm done. With you and all of this, it ends. Today. You don't even know where to start. Up down. Obviously. Up down. Thanks to the Super Chat DCC. I don't know what it says yet because it's come up on my screen. Before it's come up, there it goes. What's your favorite time loop movie, says DCC0209? Probably Groundhog Day. I like um I like lots of time. I actually quite Shit, like a lot of time in movies. I like um, Live I Die Repeat. I like what? um what Triangle. Um Wow, wow. Okay. What is this supposed to be? 
There was another one I was thinking of, and then it completely vanished from my brain holes. <clears throat> okay, it's the slab. Okay, here goes. Okay, here goes. <laughs> Looper, that's the one, Gavin. That's the one I couldn't remember. Which, uh, of course, I couldn't remember the one name that actually had Loop in the title. Okay, so I survived that area. Got all these bits of knowledge that I've discovered. And because I didn't die, I've carried these items through to the next area. The next time of the day, it's the morning. And I've got to go and find my up -down flat. Which is where I used to live in the before times. Check out the leads you've uncovered. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Let's just... Get through all this nice and quick. Let's get the double jump equipped. Um, I don't think I've got any trinkets for my shit gun. No. Oh, do I? Yeah, shock absorber. There we go. And currently, I have no slabs apart from the one that stops me from dying twice or three times. Oh, Palm Springs is pretty good as well, actually. Yeah, Nightcap. Palm Springs was a good one. Uh, I don't remember Dorsey the square, somewhere in time right, right, right Dorsey Square, oh. second floor, Dorsey Square. There's one a really cool. It's how do you know where I am? You got cameras all over some. Tower tracks your position, and you always act so surprised, like I wouldn't know exactly where you're going. I don't even know where I'm going. Uh, Dorsey Square is just down the road, cliffside. Let me guess, second floor. Sounds like you're angling for an invite. <laughs> so you can show off your little beer tap again. Different me. This cult done talking to you. Mm -hmm. By the way, everyone recognizes your stupid jacket. I like this jacket. Yeah. There's one time loop thing I saw. It's not a, not your standard average time loop movie. I can't even remember what it's called now. It's about some guys who keep a time machine in um, a storage cupboard, theater storage, like wars kind of place. <laughs> Boy. I can't remember its name though. I've got all these notes to read again. Oh, there's a naked guy coming. Uh oh. Mm. There we go. Good bit of a kicky. Kicky in the dicky. I've got a Vopat trencher. Oh, I miss all my good guns. Had some well good guns and some great powers. I'll get them back in no time. Well, maybe it might take me a little bit of time. A few people have wondered if you could complete this game in one single loop. It's not possible. Because there's there is a, like a linear narrative that runs through this game. You can do things in any order you want, but it is actually um, um, there are events that have to happen in order for you to be able to do some things. I never worked out the puzzle in this one. Signed in blood. But it says, may have crabs forever. So you need to find three three codes to open up this secret door. I, I didn't do that in my last playthrough. I was too busy trying to get to the bottom of everything. I'm feeling just fine. Okay, let's head out of this window. My apartment is just there. So let's go. Whoop! Oh, Lux. That sorted them out pretty quickly. Although, it sounds like someone is still angry with me. Oh no. It's fine. This is to be my place. It's my house, huh? 
Chewie and the Jewels. Right, let's check out my computer. Oh, a blue weapon. Let's have the blue weapon. For redecorating. Or silent headshots with pneumatic prejudice. <laughs> so one of the yeah. things that made my playthrough of this game pretty easy is that with the the definitive edition or whatever it is I got, the deluxe edition, wow. um, it unlocks pretty. a golden silenced pistol. And it's like a cheat mode, the golden silenced pistol. Never give up. I won't. I uh, got some messages. I'm not going to read all these messages, but basically, uh, Man, it gives you kind of like um, obnoxious. Should give you a little overview pop. Oh shit! Maybe I should change where yeah, I am. I compliment actually. people all the time. Yeah. Uh, because so the loops run on this side room. here, and this is too easy. After you've read a note, mm, it kind of pops easy. up with a little kind of brief overview. So it's a handwritten note, never give up. Julie and I told the other visionaries that you're going to break the loop, so Charlie kicked you out of the group channel. Charlie runs the Minicom network, which is what all the computers are linked by. And you or some other cult talked to Juliana about a loop control center. So now I need to locate the loop control center. But Charlie has finished, uh, has sent some bad guys after me. I'm finishing up down for now, though. Your next stop is the complex. You can continue to explore up, down, or head for the exit. I'm just going to uh, head for the exit and go to the complex, I think. Oh, I'm good. Because I'm good. I could go and try yes. and kill Alexis Dorsey, who lives on this island, or Charlie. Actually, who's got the... Is Wait, does Charlie have the one I like? Is Charlie even here now? Actually, no. So basically, my two favourite slabs are Shift and Nexus. With Shift and Nexus, um, you can pretty much get through the entire game uh, without breaking a sweat. Though you break a sweat sometimes, but um, you have to get them a few times to unlock all the upgrades for them and stuff. And also, a good thing to know is that this exit symbol here, it doesn't always point to the closest exit, because there are many different exits Those throughout each area. This entire island. And uh, there's one right That's here. That's how I'm getting to the complex. Uh, so I go through this door, and let's blow this joint. Do -do 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 -do. Shift is Charlie's cool, Thomas Cromus girl. Kill, kill. Oh, I can now I'm on the right. I can flip myself though. Flip mode. Transform. Flip horizontal. Look at me. I'm the right way round for once. You can read my t-shirt. <coughs> do do Nexus is the domino one that joins people together, says Night Cat. Yes, correcto. So I survived. Hooray. The complex has a loop control center. Sounds fancy and useful. Well, we better go and check that out then. I've collected a trinket, which will inflict reduced damage, but I'll suffer reduced damage. Wait, what? So this is where you piece together all your bits of knowledge. It's actually not, it, it, it seems so complicated at the start, but once you get to grips with how it all works, it's actually not hugely complicated um, piecing everything together what was that trinket it was uh, it wasn't a trinket it was a personal one. inflict reduced damage but suffer reduced damage so no I don't want that I don't want that okay so we can just go to a loot the loop control center and check that out <clears throat> oh, to find the codes for the smoke room, you need to change the pipes according to the brief of the last note you did pick up. Uh, I've got an apartment. Right, okay. okay. You didn't either. Why is that? You're going to call me like this all the time, Julie. Juliana. I give approximately zero fucks about what you call yourself. <laughs> well, you did. Once. We used to be friends. Cult. Can't you oh, read? so that's why you told everyone to kill me. But I'm the only one talking to you. So what does that tell you? That I hang out with the wrong people. All right. Control center. Shut it down. Shut it down. 
Okay, control center, shut it down. Should be easy, maybe. I don't know. I don't have any of my good weapons or powers. Go loud and proud or slow on the lowdown. Am I going to be able to jump up that? I've never snuck around this way, so I don't know. Sorry! Okay. Not too bad. Whoa! That was unnecessary. Okay, how many people are down here? Three people down here. Can I hack that from here? Doesn't look like it. Oh well, let's... Go loud and proud. A kerfuffle! <laughs> These weapons are so weak. A kerfuffle! There we go. So yeah, stealth actually, like, when I first started playing this game on the Eurogame YouTube channel, I was really, I was trying to play it a lot like Dishonored, um, and I was trying to go stealth route a lot, but you actually, it doesn't reward stealth as much as Dishonored does, and um, the enemies tend to, like, not be able to hear for very long distances. So you can get into a gunfight with that group of people and hundreds of them don't come running from across the entire map. It's, it's quite um, a small amount of people um, that you have to deal with most times. There are parts of levels where you get loads and loads of people coming at you, but um, in general, it doesn't hurt to go loud too much as long as you've got enough ammo and you're aware of your, uh, your surroundings. Okay, if Colt gets in here, the party's over. Oh, station says Junko sealed. Wants it closed, which means I want it open. Yeah, well, we'll have to try and get that open at another point. Here's the control room. What have we got in here? Might be nice to... Actually, fuck it. That'll do. Whoa. Okay. Didn't die. Gotta be a switch. Around here somewhere. Gotta be a switch. Gotta be a switch. Gotta make a switch. Oh, make a switch. Oh. This looks like it does something important. I did a switch. The... Hi, Igor. Oh. oh, you gotta be kidding me. So what? I gotta find a tutorial. Here's a tutorial about how to change batteries. So here's the battery. The batteries actually don't play as huge a role in this game as I thought they would either. There's a few big battery based things, but in general, you don't have to use okay. it if you don't want to. Show me what you can do. I'm playing stealthy found a purple science SMD G near the beginning of my playthrough and it's amazing, says Gavin. Yeah, the uh, the purple SMG is one of the best guns in the game for deaths. Yeah, there are achievements in this game for, like, doing a full loop um, without killing any, um, what are they called? LPP? Extremists. No, what are they called? The NPCs, not the visionaries, the other ones. Okay, so I need to find the LPP. LPP sounds... So he does. Could do some damage. Yeah, let's go get the LPP. 
Let's do it. Let's go get the LPP. So to do that, I need to head back to an exit. It's pointing me this way. I think is a different exit to the way I came in. But that's fine. Oh, uh, no, it's the same one. I wonder if I can get across the ice. Did I do that on the Eurogamer stream? If you fall in the water here, it's like instant death. There we go. Nice. Lovely stuff. Okay, so that was a quick visit to the complex. I'm playing, I'm playing all this stuff kind of quick just because I've covered this ground on the Eurogame stream. Can't do anything with that yet. I finally found out what those are for after the Eurogame stream as well. During the Eurogame stream I was like, what's that on? Or, or, or what's all this stuff, huh? Boo -doo boo Okay. I survived. There's an old power station beneath the loop control center. Juliana doesn't want me in there, though. I need to go and find out what the LPP is. Okay. And I've got all my discoveries here as well. Explore Freestad Rock next. So all this is... Um, part of the prologue basically um, the game doesn't really open up and become what it is until you get past this point and you get to the point where you can choose what okay, times of day to and what kind of places oh, to go to, to I want to know if you figured out who you really are oh that's easy I'm a drinker occasionally a drunk man about island everyone knows me everyone hates me handy with a gun quick with a joke I dress well and why the fuck is everyone wearing a mask you forgot to mention a little it's a heck of a jig. I'm done playing this your way. It's the cult show from now on. <laughs> okay, all aboard, sweetie. Choo choo. I said cult choo -choo. show, not cult. Oh. Fuck it. Next stop, I got stuck on some feet. Choo choo. Choo choo, more like kick kick, motherfucker. Oh. Eternalist. That's what they're called. Did he die? Oh, he did now. Oh, shit. Did he die? Yeah, he died. Get my silenced gun up. This is a pretty tight room. Do, 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 do. Oh. oh, fuck. That happens to be on the Eurogamer stream as well. Stupid bloody turret. The light's too bright there, so I didn't see the turret lights. Got ya. Bear, 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 bear. What? Excellent boot to the face. Oh, look at this guy. He's one of my favourites to kick off. Wee! Sploosh! See you later, sir. Do a little bit of hacking to get through the door. Okay, LPP. Where's the LPP? Where is the safe? The safe is in my up-down flat. You're saying? 
On Black Reef, knowledge is progress. You will need to return to a location armed with new information. Now that you've found the code to your safe, for example, you head back to your flat in Updarm to crack that baby open. So there you go. Fear had your safe Fucking move second. from your I office to your apartment. OTP, which okay. means it's in my flat. Back in fucking up, Dom. Damn it. Uh, <laughs> Head of security. Mysterious no slabs grant some of the visionaries unusual oh, power. Fuck. Oh, I got that. Oh, a blue Volpat trencher. I'll swap that. Okay, well, we've, we've pretty much done in uh, Freestad Rock now. For now, at least. So we just have to head back to the exit. Weom! Boink, boink! And don't forget to kick the snowman. And we're through. Wee -wee. Honestly, I've done. What time is it? I've done in 30 minutes. What took me about two hours in the Eurogamer stream? <laughs> How long do your first playthrough take you, Ian? Says Gavin. Um, gosh, four hours on Eurogamer. Then about six hours that same night. Then about another six hours. Probably about 16 hours. Poor snowman, says Tyler. I'm sorry, Tyler. Don't worry. It'll be back the next loop. Harriet Morse is responsible for Aeon's organizational structure, also the masks. Uh, okay, Cass's code for the pack to smoke is 7063. I've got to go back to my flat in Updam, but it's the evening now. Lol, six hours in one night. Well, technically it was ten hours in one day, Gavin. <laughs> and then six hours in the second night. Bleep, blop, bleep, bleep. Juliana. Juliana, you there? Juliana. I remembered your name. It was top secret. Spill it, asshole. <laughs> okay, okay. The best place to see the fireworks is. <laughs> Excellent scream, sir. So it's night time now in Updarm, so slightly different. A clientele. Oh, God, where'd you go? Ah, couldn't get him off the edge. Shame. Shame, shame. Wee! Hey, Name Father has become a member. High five! Or updated their membership. One of the two. <laughs> Definitely different. Um, you can tell the difference in my playstyle <laughs> now <laughs> than before. Frank sends fireworks up every evening, huh? Uh, 
I hereby solemnly swear on my name, life, junk, and everything that I will never reveal the contents of the room to any other person, living, dead, or in perpetuity. So I, too, shall hold the secret existence of the pact. So, too, the members of this conspiracy. If I break this oath, oath may I have crabs for every loop, forever. Well, I still don't understand how that works. Wee, my house has been smashed up. The safe, no, it's been opened. Yoink took your precious LPP, Juliana. No, no. Juliana took the LPP. Also, she said you were boring. Where's my LPP? I'm not done. This isn't your show. Oh, the note in the other room. That what this is? Some sort of hostile job takeover. How does security protects the loop? The opposite of whatever it is you're doing right now. Cool. So I'll just do your own thing then. What was that? Riding hacky bullshit for a bunch of dick bags and uh, I don't. Looks like somebody came by to say hi. I'm not finished yet. I lock the doors so the two of you can get acquainted. What? what? Doors. Two little tunnels. Brilliant design, really, and all courtesy of the captain. Yeah. Wait. Shit. Fuck this. Gonna lock my tunnels. Then I'll just have to unlock them. Juliana's on the hunt, huh? So this is um, AI Juliana. You have to... Hey! Oh, she's found me already. Haha! <laughs> Okay, so I have to unlock these. Thi I have to hack these things to be able to unlock my tunnels. So um, that can get quite scary when you um, you're being invaded by an actual real-life Juliana, and you have to kind of try and make it to safety. Uh, but you also have to hack the thingy. There's another note somewhere, is there? Or maybe it's not here at this time of day. Oh, fuck. Oh, bad time to reload. Do, do, do. Okay, what you get? Shift. Nice. Boink. It's only baby shift, though. You can only shift once. In the, in the air. Input code. Let's get the rock out of here. Do do boo. I'll unlock your tunnels, says Kate Lily. Oh my. Yoink, says Gavin. I totally did a yoink there. Yoink. Oh. Death loop. Okay, you survived. Juliana didn't. Good. Return in the morning. Julia ran, Juliana ran up my safe during the day. Too bad. It'll be waiting for me in the morning. So I collected shift, but when I start another day, shift is going to be gone. Ah, all right. LPP. Save. Gotta get to the safe before. Is there ever explain why slams and whatnot cannot uh, continue oh, through gun. loops? Yas. Yas it is. Ah, shit, fuck. My weapons are gone. All right, well, I better get some weapons again. Same day. Which means I already know what's going to happen. Yeah. yeah. And I'm sick of waking up on this fucking beach. What? Am I supposed to do this every day for the rest of my life? Fuck that. I'm breaking this loop. Yeah, what? Very impressive. I'm clapping with one hand. <laughs> Don't stop there. Put them both together. The body count is gonna get high. You got me and a few others, but you really want to kill everyone on the island? Not efficient. 
I'm starting to feel kind of bad. <laughs> I feel fantastic. Thanks for asking. And if you try that ambush shit again, expect the same outcome. <laughs> Okay. So now we know that Juliana hasn't ransacked my safe yet. So all, all we right. have to do is grab get all this nonsense. Hard. Get the safe. LPP. Break the loop. Let's go. Never gonna get used to that. Later on, they streamline all this bit as well, so you don't have to keep waking up on the beach properly all the time and things. A newish dawn. Juliana stole your LPP. Let's go get that LPP back. Got some gear. Got my trinkets. Gonna have to put them back in my loadout because. I haven't been able to store them yet. But we get to that bit quite soon. I didn't get to it in my Eurogamer uh, Let's Play, but it happens. Happens soonish. I'll get to it here easy because I'm going super fast through this. I, I have um, I've, I've zoomed through this compared to the pace I took it out of the Eurogamer um, stream. So if you want to check out this beginning bit, in a bit slower detail, if you feel like I'm rushing through a little bit, um, do check out the Eurogamer stream I did, where I go through it all in painstaking detail, reading all the notes and um, checking out all the scenery and things. Um, for now, I just want to get past this prologue bit and um, get to the main game. Um, Every day I wake up and kick that person off the thing. It's, it's like my morning ritual. You go look at that. Someone else can worry about that. Oh, phew. That's close. Didn't think I was going to make it. You crazy kids are a heartbeat from the happiest place on this rock. The library. Okay, allegedly there's a note here. Uh, it's up like you asked, ready to ruin Vanya and An Anatoly's first day, which is kind of a dick move, you know? I mean, only reason I agreed to this loop, to this is loop on no murderer. Anyway, you know what you owe me, I expect it tomorrow, next week. Remember, yellow pipe's the safe pipe. Leave the button alone, or oh, you're not uh, like as, oh, okay. Yellow pipe is the safe pipe, so let's change that to that. So we know one of the we know one of the codes already. So now I kill one person and then come back later on today and get their code and so on and so forth. Okay. All right, LPP, show me something good. Oh, it's a book. And what is this book all about? Can't bother to read it. It's the recipe for a broken time loop. Kill all the visionaries in a single day. One day that's harder than it sounds. You. Yep. Oh, all right. So, so what's the plan? Eight targets one day. We're gonna need a couple more colts in here if we're gonna wreck this island in a cold storm. What? No. Listen, I can't stay long. How did you even get in here? Didn't you get shot two loops ago, or was it three? Show me Different ways. Codes. Look, there's huh? thousands of us, or more. I, I don't know, but none of us have gotten it right. Okay. You gotta be better than all of us, so don't just try to shoot everything. But oh. I like shooting you things. You gotta be smart. It's the only way to fix this. This and this. Mm -hmm. I prefer the Cold Storm plan. Manji's lab. Figure out residuum, it'll make your life easier. Or do it the hard way. Whatever. Hand holding is over. What, what, what are you looking at? Why are you... Son of a bitch. All right. Let's get started. One of the things that kind of annoys me about LPP this game is that those... <laughs> those cults occasionally pop up and then they just disappear. And that's never a thing that you can do. Well, I guess you can turn yourself invisible with um, a slab. Maybe that's what he's doing to get away. I don't know. Seems like they're more like visions or... or, or 
something, and um, you can't do that yourself. I think I've read everything in here. Who is she? Who is she? Okay, I need to find Wenji's lab. Let's get rid of those things. Okay, so we head into the exit now to Wenji's lab. Oh, I did do Wenji's lab on the Eurogamer um, stream. Oh. Do -do -do. The levels themselves, they there's so many different routes and um, different ways around and different little secrets and stuff. On. But um, I'm kind of just sticking at the moment to this one route because it's the quickest way to route. Um, they, they feel like incomprehensibly big when you first play them. Uh, and because there's so much stuff going on. But they do kind of, you know, the more you get to play them and the more you get to know the level layout, they do you know, just kind of shrink in your brain a little bit. Hey, t Drifting Finds! Will you change Colt's outfit, says Thomas Kramaskoli. Um, I don't, I've only got that one Colt outfit, and um, so far, which you get for the deluxe edition, the and can't protocol. change it yet. A bunch of big words to make a you have to get to a certain point before I you can change every visionary it. In one day. I heard the AI in this game is bad, says Bukat. Yeah, it's, it's time, pretty bad. I'm guessing it won't be as easy some as of them are very, bad. like, you can kill Good someone right I'm next to someone and they just fire. won't notice. Sometimes they'll notice. But yeah, there are, um, there are some pretty bad uh, bits of AI. Oh, here we go. Um... So we're at the point where we can choose time of day and the levels now. Click on Arsenal leads. So we want to find Wenji's research. Okay. But that's um, something we can think about later. We, we have to go to the complex at noon to do that. So this is just the tutorial for all this crap, actually. Okay, and then we want to go complex at noon to find Dr. Wenji um, and uh, find out what the hell is going on with all this crazy bullshit. Oof, that text is a bit small, says Fire Rabbit. Yeah, it kind of throws a lot of walls of like tiny text at you at the start, which again. It's quite like, whoa, that's a lot to take in. But once you make, once it clicks, and, the, and you know what you're doing, it's actually kind of quite simple. But yeah, I think it's kind of not a great design, the, the walls of text. My weapons again? The infusion process? Isn't that why you came up here? Not gonna lie. Me told me to. You're not the only one with other me's, you know. You're not special. Yeah, but if I succeed... Yeah, if. Good luck. This infusion keeps sounding better and better. So, we need to learn how and whoa, how and why things are... I mean, let's not go that way. We need to learn how and why things keep disappearing and how we can keep them in our pockets. <laughs> Just didn't even need to do that. Just a big troll. Ass end of everything. Made a bit of noise there. See, that might work in my favour. Ooh, maybe not though. Coming around here. Whoa! It's uh, a bit wonky, but I got there in the end. Ammo. See that bit of texture flicker there? Already got full ammo. 
I, I think that's way worse on the, um, the PC from what I gather. Where did, we, where did the second person go? Oh well. Okay, ship's open. Or whatever the hell it is. So let's get in here and kill some wenchies. Yikes. That's right, Wenji. Some good Wenjiing, Wenji. What the fuck? Where's that light going? Night, night, Wenji. Oh, oh. Some of them neck snaps say brutal. Brutal, brutal, brutal. Okay, we've got two Wenjis upstairs. And we're about to put them both to sleep. Maybe. I don't like the thought of that banister. It's probably going to catch my nail if I'm not careful. Remind me why I can't have a coastal. Oh, there we go. Got the, got the coffee maker and then for a second. Real good. Okay, there's a Wenji on the roof. Um, Don't get greedy, Colt. Nope, I'm good. See if there's anything to read around here. I didn't check down below for stuff to read. One Wenji is one too many. Here you go, what's that? A lockdown code. I'm no expert, but... Oh, wait, I am. This code I found at Wedgie's facility looks connected to a depressurization chamber. It's not, not that one. It's, it's not for in there. Okay. Let's go get some more Wedgie's. There's quite a few to kill. I think there's like 12 or something. Gagga gang 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 gang. This is Dr. Wendy Evans. Of the Hi, Wendy. The Eon program. I was tasked with creating a highly interdependent thermodynamic system that would allow us to harness the vast energy produced by Black Roof's anomaly. With some ingenious reverse engineering, I was able to repurpose the stabilizer intended to harness power from the anomaly and drive it into the core. By placing myself and the other visionaries at the center of the stabilizer core, I was able to. Yum, yum, yum. Anomaly's energy into us. Now, Imbue, you say? The visionaries are the loop. And I can still perform field tests on the breach phenomenon without endangering the program, barring any failure of our protocol, which would be, well... To shreds, you say? We should experience the loop state every day for approximately... 13,562 years. Shit. It's too bad I'm gonna end the program after 50. <coughs> Stop gassing, you two. Arguing with herself there. Okay, here we go. Let's finally, we'll finally stop chatting and splitting up a little bit. A very little bit. Here we go. Whoop. Bloody hell. Show me your head. Fuck. Oh well, that went wrong. Thanks, pissing telescope. Well, that's fucked my plan. We're not stalling anymore, friendos. Oh, and I died. 
Well, that was absolutely uncalled for. I'm furious. That was, uh, that was kind of bullshit, that. That telescope definitely was absorbing my shots there. I had a clear line of sight on her head. I was robbed, I tells thee. Robbed. Uh. <laughs> Fuck! Right, this nail gun's a piece of shit. Eight more? Seven. Reload ever! Fuck me! I don't have my shotgun anymore. Titties! So do. Oh boy! That could have gone a lot smoother because I wanted to try and. Um, Trap them in here and depressurize the uh, the area, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to do that now because I think they all ran out here to attack me. Oh well. Oh well. It's really a simple matter of not missing, says Kate Lily. Yeah, that's true. Percent loss. Bringing the vessel here from the control room is. Wessel! Oh, you did right. Wow. Alright. Tough girl, eh? Oh, oh, shit. That's bad. I got caught by a security camera and it popped up that ballistic turret, which could have been very bad for me indeed. Very bad indeed. But we're good. I don't know how many Wengies are left to kill. Oh, a few more. A couple more. A plague of Wengies. Right. Got that. <laughs> when she wants to oh, when she wants to harvest <laughs> enough residium for the infuser, she could kill every last one. She, when she wants to use the residium to anchor an object to an individual. So the re residium will anchor objects to an individual. This magical made up yeah, compound called residium. Anchors the items to the individual, which means they can bring them round the loop, basically. So, you shouldn't be able to bring things through the loop, but residium means you can, basically. Okay, I need to get the, the sucky muck harvester. All right, let's figure this shit out. An observation from this morning's early announcements. Did I play that already? Skill and proficiency of a terrorist called Juliana. So now, okay. and two years of the skill. One, the time loop has been active for some time, and both of them retain the memories from each loop iteration. I think I got it then. Most notably ourselves, do not, for fuck's sake, stop interrupting me. I just accidentally threw it, so it missed the animation. All right. 
Now, just get in this tube shower thing and press the button. So this is going to put residium into my body and allow me to carry things through the loops. Shoot the button. And here we go. It won't hurt. It's definitely residium. Gavin, thanks to that person who was like, it's a great let's play, but I can't stand it that Ian calls with residium. So now, it is residium. Just like when I called vlogs vlogs for about five years, just to annoy one person who commented on a video in a shitty way. <laughs> Okay, Wenji died. Wenji doesn't have anything cool, though. She doesn't have any cool slabs. But she does have to die every time if you want to break the loop. Fnurf! <laughs> so I, suppose, I think I've done in one hour, what seven minutes, what I did in four hours in the Eurogamer stream. It uh, worked? Yeah, I think it's pronounced Visigium. Oh, yeah. Like the D-U-U is like a J. Who's the super oh, what should I call you? Mr. Gun feels a bit uh, formal. Gun tur, gonna slav. Maybe the machine. Eh. Why does it feel like I'm more here? This shit makes no sense. So now I can pick up Residium Combat from those Camera. glowy objects. And this acts as kind of currency or like Dark Souls souls. Instead of leveling up, you use it to basically buy trinkets that you found. Well, not buy them, like pay to keep them almost. Do do do. Yup. Go. Now I'm harvesting. Miracle. Let's uh, get out of here. Now that has a ring to it. <laughs> it's too self-involved. Cold second. Point. Yeah. Cold two. Cold sweat. Why the fuck am I naming this gun after me? Yum 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 yum. And give me the slab. Come on. I slipped away into the tunnels. Yeah, I did. Okay, I slipped. I survived. It hurt like a mother, but it worked. So I collected some trinkets again. Got these weapons. Now, it's going to tell me about the power of infusion. Got to touch the shimmery things to get residium. I mean residium. And then I can infuse my gear to keep it with me for all time. Now, here's where I can also get my good shit. Weapon trinkets. So it wants me to sacrifice this, I think. Does it? No. There you go. Sacrifice that, and I'll gain 500 residium. And then weapons. It wants me to. It wants me to infuse this shit gun. Does it? Okay. Fine. Now I've got no residium. Brilliant. I better not die in this next bit then. Slabs in particular provide potent supernatural abilities, so I'm going to definitely want to um, infuse those. So what do I have to do next? I need to check out the clues I've uncovered and find leads to, it, to uh, unlocking the secrets of Black Reef. Remember, each district offers different opportunities 
different times of the day. And I've got it on online mode now, so I could be in, invaded by a, uh, an online player, which would suck at the moment, because I've got no good shit. And the only people invading at the moment are people that have been playing the game loads, because they're the only ones that can be bothered to wait for 15 minutes per time. Okay, so we've got some discoveries, blah, blah. Don't need to know any of that. Let's have a look at my visionary leads. So at the moment I've got leads on four visionaries. Charlie, Igor, oh did I? I did get to this part in the Eurogamer stream because I went to Gate Crush Charlie's game, I think. I can't remember, it was four, it was long. Um, both Harry and Frank are only taking the... I'm gonna get Harry at first. Is it going to be better to get Charlie? Basically, Charlie and Harriet are, are my favourite ones to um, uh, my favourite ones to get. Actually, I'll go. I'll go Harriet because Charlie's not available until noon, and Harriet is available in the morning. Here we got a list of all the slabs that are available at the moment. We want Harriet's Nexus slab. And we want uh, we want Charlie's slab as well, Charlie's shift slab. But like I said, I can't get that till noon. Um, I don't have any residium anymore, which sucks. But let's change my loadout and get. Let's equip this and hope to God I don't die and lose it. And I'll get the Volpat trencher in there as well. Um, I don't think I've got any trinkets. No trinkets. I do have... Double jump. And let's get Golden Harvest as well. I've definitely got no slabs. Okay. Oh, and uh, if I did want to... I could also change uh, cult style. I've only unlocked two of the 13 outfits. I don't know how you unlock the outfits, actually. This outfit is one of the deluxe passes, but I don't I think cult looks better with a, with a beard, to be honest with you. The dogs. So we're going to keep it. I'm going to keep cult like that. And I think I'm ready to go and seize Harriet's Nexus Slab, which is going to be tricky without any powers. Oh, I recall you going to the Shaggin Shack, but couldn't get in. Oh, yes. You can actually get into the Shaggin Shack, um, but not when anyone's in there shagging, unfortunately. Hey, Juliana, I infused myself a gun. Might infuse some trinkets. I might infuse a slab. Uh, what's your point? Then I figured out how to infuse things. This is the first time. When did you crack that shit on day seven? Then why'd I have to do it again? It's got something to do with memory. Stuff you can't recall just sort of slips away. Fuck! Why do you even like this place? Because it is amazing. It's the only amazing place in an entire world of shit. You'll see it eventually. All I see is me one step closer to breaking this fucking... You always come around. Boopity boop. boop. I need to get some more. Um, I need to get some trinkets for this gun as well. This gun normally kills. In my other playthrough, this gun would kill people one shot. Because I powered out with some trinkets. Oh, for the outfits, you need to play as Juliana. Oh, no. I'd be lucky if I can get into a match as Juliana, so... Check. Breakthrough. Check and fucking mate. I'm not gonna ah! shove your 
ethical waffling, Susan. Anything's an acceptable <laughs> Shove your eth sacrifice. ethical waffling, Susan. Oh, that guy over there nearly spotted me. Let's go and uh, make sure he doesn't spot me again. There we go. One shot. One kill. Boink. Okay, what we got here? He's dropped some trinkets, a personal trinket and a weapons trinket. So Harriet's hangers over there. There's a lot of a uh, lot of people to get past, but I also I do want to get myself a nice bit of residuum for when I leave the level. There we go. It's just I wasn't hitting headshots, I think, which is why. Those people are dying straight away, I guess. That's much better. Look at that. Now, now we're cruising. Weird. good in here. Big smiley. There's a lot of masks and things fine. in here. Cool room though. Door locked. Amador closed his mask in him so he could play the sacrifice in Harriet's ritual. Amador may die today but he'll be back tomorrow for more masks he thinks. So maybe if uh, I can stop Amador from dying, that door will be open next time I come in here. Oh, I'm good. There's a lot of these how well do you know black... Fuck! There's a lot of those how many... How do you know black reef... Um, how well do you know black reef pickups. They... Um, They teach you things that you'll need to open, to unlock a weapon um, in, a, in a little game that I can show you up here if it's open. Just make sure no one's around. Did the one I killed up here drop anything? No. Yeah, and the Queen of Riddles here. There's a quiz to do. But obviously there's a lot of answers. And there's like 10, 11 questions? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Ten questions. What seed did Aeon spring? Um, well, I think that's the shared ambitions of Harriet Morse, maybe? Correct. The wriggling, writhing energies of the loop have been harnessed to gift us with abilities beyond our biological potential. What birthed the trinkets and the slabs? I think Dr. Wenji Evans. Yeah. Harriet Morse is the gatekeeper. Black Reef the gate. A veil hangs across the threshold. What do we discover when it parts? I don't know. This one. I'm going to say the great beyond. I, I have no idea. Oh, I was right. Nice. Okay. Black Reef boasts a bountiful feast for the senses, which transcendent work towers above the island's myriad other artistic pursuits. Oh, gosh. Uh, the Orla and Gideon Fry. Okay, wrong. So you have to get all ten of them right to be able to unlock. I think it's a weapon, anyway. I don't know what the code for that is yet. That's kind of basically a game of how m much you've paid attention to the story. I guessed the quiz the first time and almost got them all correct, says Gavin. 
Oh, the web, the bot's back again. Oh, cheers, mods. Those bots are a bloody nightmare. Oh, oh, someone's going in the sea. Boink! Sploosh! I love the way they just straighten up and flop in. Oh. See? Careful now. Yeah, it gets a bit hairy around here. Whoa. Wow, that turret's fucking sensitive. Need to get closer, but I've got to wait until it. Let's turn it evil. Well, good. Let's turn it good. Evil for them, good for me. Let's hope no one up there can hear. Look, this. There's, there's someone there, and there's a bunch of people in this building, but they don't hear. They don't hear so good. Hi, hey, uh, hi, gun. Thanks for being good. Wizardian. What, where are they going to? Dead. Oh. Did he? Who saw me? Fucking saw me. Is that him? Well, I don't know why he saw me then, but he did. There's a weird force field there. That force field is a um, it's a barrier that stops you from being able to use your slabs. Don't need it. I don't actually have any slabs at the moment, so it doesn't really matter to me. But Whoop. flop. No brains for you, sir. this door without anyone seeing. Good. So what I need to do is get into there. But the only way in is through this bridge. Let's get some residuum first. You also hear that noise that sounds a little bit like a Fortnite chest. That's the sound of a trinket. But it's locked inside this building, uh, this little shed. Frank filled a container in Carlsbad with fireworks, handled with care, it says. But we don't know how to get in yet. So we can't get those. Okay. Someone's on that walkway. I need to get up to that walkway. So it's going to be a little bit trickier than normal, because normally I'd just use my shift powers to manoeuvre around. Sorry. Ooh, How many people? There's this one. There was that one. See what I mean about this gun making it a bit of a cheat mode. Wonderful. I feel like there's bound to be at least one more person in here somewhere. It's 
too empty. I don't want to run around just yet. Cause sound of your footsteps, especially when you're running, um, can anger folks. Uh, again, let's collect as much residuum, residuum as I can. Follow the sound of bullshit. Well, you've made it to the right place. Welcome to Platform 32. Don't tell me if it's a story spoiler, but there's a nullifier up on the side of that building. Do you know how to get in there, says Gavin? I've tried to get in there and I can't figure it out. Um, I don't know. That was the first time I'd noticed that nullifier, to be honest. Um, I presume something opens when you do the, the puzzle in there. Um, I don't know how else you'd be able to get in there with the nullifier there. Unless there's one time of the day when a nullifier isn't turned on. Oh fuck, this is going to be really hard actually. I've just realised without the shift ability. I'm not 100% sure I'm going to do this. Oh well. So there's the mask just guy that doesn't yeah. look is gonna get killed, this guy here. He's gonna be sacrificed in a ritual that Harriet is doing. Thanks for subscribing. Hello, luck. Oh, God. Yeah, how am I going to get through there? Can I shoot the button? Yeah. Hopefully, it stays open. He got. He got sacrificed. Embrace the chaos. Oh, they're wandering around, and the door is still open. That's good for me. Where's Harriet off? Is she going to come into? Because this is Harriet's office here. Is she going to come in here? She might. Maybe. Yeah. Work for. The fuck? Okay, I think we're good to read our computer quickly. Still some stuff. Okay, Juliana, tell the other visionaries something, something. Hurry, <laughs> it takes the LPP more seriously than the other visionaries. I've completed the Chaos Theory story. One of these days, Frank's obsessions with fireworks is going to get killed. Break into Frank's is the next thing it wants me to do. Is a new thing it wants me to do. After they emptied a bottle of whiskey, Harriet hinted to Frank that she knew the origin of the anomaly. Igor discovered Black Reef with a little help from a friend. So these are all bits of clues that we're picking up. Let's read these pieces of paper, brief interview with Harriet Morse, wellness author and human resource manager. Now Harriet keeps a list of dirty secrets on her fellow visionaries. Okay, 
Let's close that door so that I can't be snuck up upon. Right, Harriet Moore's dead. Oh, shit. Unfortunately, her pals are here. Steal all the residuum. Soak that up. I've got an exo slab now. This is a good start. That's full of gas. Hello, Kindred. How's it going? Okay, that's her signature gun, I think. So let's let's pick that up. Not that I use it much, because I've got my lovely uh, silenced pistol, and then I've got. Um, the shotgun for when things get really hectic. And there's a little exit out the back door. So now I just need to get the rock out of here. There's one person here. And they're dead. Quite like to get a group of people together and show you how cool the Nexus is. I'm going to do it here. So it joins people and then they share their fate. What you do to one person, everyone else shares their fate. So basically you headshot one person and uh, they all die. I've managed to oops, link together, I think, seven people, I think, in one go, which looked pretty fucking awesome when I uh, batted them all. Should probably try and get out of here though before Juliana comes, because if, um, if I get jumped by a Juliana now, I am gonna lose a lot of stuff, and, uh, and I don't wanna do that. What? Yes, me. <laughs> no, it's not good, but it's good for me. <laughs> right, lug it. Smashy bottles. And get the fuck out of here. Peace. Wait, wrong one. LOL! It's too many doors. Peace! There's got to be a way to kill two of them at once. Or Domino and Dishonored was OP four. like this. You could train like <laughs> six more. people, says Gavin. Yeah, no. you can even do you can do even this. more well, maybe uh, than six in this. It runs out, it makes the power run out. The more people you um, connect, the faster your power runs out but you can get an upgrade for next the more you kill uh harriet the more upgrades you get and one of them uh it drains less power so i killed harriet morse dead harriet morse she not dead um these are all the things i learnt. i've unlocked this next slab got all these trinkets And looks yeah. like Harriet plays by the protocol's rules. I've got exactly one shot at her. Her morning sermon in Carl Vague. Lol. Okay, Harriet is down. Now, we've got two visionaries um, that we can see here in Noon. We've got Charlie 
And we've got fear. Fear's uh, Havoc Slab is... I only find it good for playing as Juliana because it makes you really tough and hard to kill. And when you're up against someone with three lives and you've only got one life, you need all the help you can get. So, uh, But I, I never really used the Havoc Slab on my playthrough, uh, my first playthrough of this. Uh, so my next spot, uh, my next stop is going to be up down. But first, we want to go into my loadout, and we want to infuse gear, and we definitely want to. Oh, maybe. Ah, oh, okay, cool. Oh, that's good. I get to keep these anyway. That's excellent news. Um, I don't need that Vopat trencher because I've already got a Vopat trencher, so I'm just going to sacrifice that one. There's some more, more goodies. And then I might as well, um, this is a four pounder that releases toxic gas on impact. I'll never use it, but I'll infuse it. I'll infuse it so I don't lose it, but I'll never use it. Um, and this one, to infuse I need 1,500, so I'm gonna probably need to sacrifice a few trinkets here. Let's sacrifice all the low level trinkets. And that should um, that should be plenty. And let's infuse the Nexus. Now I get to keep it. Each slab has four upgrades. Um, but currently I have no upgrades for Nexus. Don't matter though, don't matter. Not too bothered. Have I got enough to so I need eight thousand. It would be good to Golden Harvest I can keep already. That must have cut, must be um deluxe edition thing. Double jump in midair, classic maneuver. I'd quite like to keep that. Um, but I need 8,000. I'm not going to be able to afford that. I'm not going to be able to afford anything else. So what I'm going to do is just um, infuse whatever. What have I got? Aim down the sights takes us time. Accuracy of aim shots good. Mind leech and... Sure. Get all them goodies on that one. And then uh, the trencher. I'll just put whatever I've got left in that. That'll do. That'll do. That'll do. Let's go see Charlie and try and loot his shift slab. Gate crash Charlie's game. Go for it. Uh, thanks for the ban hammering. Ian, that gun is actually good. The gas can be exploded, says Rito Sin. Oh. How do you explode the gas? I tried sh I tried shooting at the uh, gas. Ability yet. Do I, Charlie? No, but I'm coming to get it. I'm coming to get it. Boom. So what, if I get killed by, like, uh, Juliana or something, it's going to be well annoying because I'll, I'll lose my double jump and I'll have to wait to find another one. That'll be poopy buttholes. Ha ha! Making that noise. Sounds like there's a slab in there, uh, not a slab, a trinket in there. Is there someone up? Oh, there is. <gasps> Fuck. Oh, <laughs> shot. Thanks, Auto Aim. Okay, the library. There's a few people. Buy it. Now two dead people buy it. Can't resist. Ooh. Ah. 
Boink, boink. My chat disconnected. Hold on. There we go. Oh, is it? Sorry, I didn't realise the stream had stopped for a second there. I don't know what's going on with my internet, but it doesn't, like, recently, like in the last few days, it's been, every day it's been, like, dropping for, like, a couple of seconds and then coming back again. Which is a bit annoying. Do do. Yeah, baby. Oh, that was a long way down. Nice. Oh, look at all my lovely shift routes that I can't take. Oh, well, I can. Down there. What am I looking at? Black shadow. What? Can't see it? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> what kind of hit people with today? Whoever enters the building next will be the new invader. At least that's what two bit told me. Whoa. You actually talk to that thing? Like conversational? Uh yeah. Just like Charlie. But you know, funnier. Okay. Hello. No, no. That's dead. Yeah, yeah, dead. Yeah, yeah. Oh, fuck. Yep, yeah, yeah, dead. Okay. Dealt with them a lot easier than I did on the Eurogamer Let's Play as well. Oh! Bye bye! Oh, oh, what a cartwheel. She cartwheeled so hard. She uh, phased through the rocks. Thank. Thanks, parkour. Don't get greedy, Colt. Find Charlie's minicon. Don't mind if I do. Probably should try and be a Don't bit better it. with the headshots, though. Yeah. Something went blah up on your side, Ian. It's night cat. Damn it. Always, always with the blarping. There's a lot of enemies in this um, area, but they stay very well hidden. So it's easy to like rile them all up and then suddenly there's just hundreds coming at you and you're like, where the fuck are they coming from, y'all? So with that, shift at the moment. I can't, like, get up there nice and quick, either. One person on their own, there. Kid shit, kid shit. Oh, so got to wait for my, um, my cast to run out before my power comes back again. A big bling, bling. I don't know what it was though. I didn't see. Was it a super chat or was it what? I'm not sure. 
Oh, it was uh, someone's become a member. Thank you for becoming a member, Adam. High five, Adam. You wonderful legend, you. Thanks for supporting the channel. Kisses. Um, look at the. It's such great level design, though. Really imaginative. Worse. Our heads were disabled by a bullet. Hum, 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 hum. Okay, I think this is another little side room. Yeah, let's get the residium from there. What's this say? Charlie made sure 2-Bit could evacuate the entire building in an emergency. I am an emergency. 2-Bit may not be a robot butler, but he can get the door for you. I'm going to have to go through this entire game to get to Charlie, I think, because um, all my little shortcuts are not reachable for me at the moment. I don't have shift. Oh, that's not a door. Oh. Invader has to strike again. It is clandestine. Killing investigators. Look out! Can't make that door. I wish I could, because that's a good door to be in. Guess I'm going to have to go this way. Past the invaders. That's not good. Let's um, hack my way into here. All right. The captain. What the? What the? It talks. Two-bit system managed for condition detachments. A master Charlie game. Uh -huh. Oh, it was a membership I renewal, captain. was it? Uh, well, thanks for renewing your membership, Adam. You know I want to break the loop? Two-Bit remembers last time. What last time? Master Charlie made Two-Bit with bioprocessor for ultra-smart storage. Is that a piece of brain? <laughs> Ooh. So, uh, what do you do? Two-Bit system managed for condition detachment. A Master Charlie game. Uh-huh. Also broadcasts to hold Black Reef through public address ports. Maybe you hear them. They're my favorite. Got some new commands to try on you. Stupid loves commands. Hooray. Let's see if we can evacuate all personnel from the planet. So, Tubit, I need you to evacuate the whole building. Evacuate? Why dumb gameplay? I don't know. The, the invader brought a virus or something? Twist plot. Master Charlie will sparkle hard. All personnel advised. Evacuation is go! Now, exit building! I repeat, now, exit building! Okay. That should make getting to Charlie's workstation a bit easier. Oh, sorry, Master oh. Charlie. Ooh. Why? Why are you sorry? Master Charlie's angry. Legendary. Do you know what? I 
need to know where Charlie is. He's down there. Yeah. Oh, he's okay. He's shifting around a lot. Oh, there he. Oh, fuck. Okay, we're in trouble. Not anymore. We're not. Charlie Montague, dead. So Charlie's dropped some cool stuff. He's dropped a Strelak 50-50. Did I... Did I... Save this gun? I can't remember. The Strelak 50-50 is okay. But it's not as good as this gun that I've got now. So I've got the shift slab now anyway. So now I can... Uh, zoop! Zip, zap, zoop around. And... Um, okay, good demon. No, there's no uh, no enemies in here because I got two bits to get rid of everyone. Ha ha ha! Thanks, two bit. If you kill Charlie before you ask two bit to um, uh, evacuate everyone, he won't do it. He gets all angry with you. Is that what? No, I'm, nope, not, I'm good. not doing that, motherfucker. You killed my boss. Okay, it's uh, pretty empty up here. Bit of ammo. Already got full ammo. Oh no, more bots, boo. Um, right, well, here's Charlie's minicom is here. So let's just have a quick read of these and then see what happens. Oh Charlie blocked Alexis from sending Wenji messages on the minicom system. Got a chop yeah? fuck down. And Charlie and Fear plan a secret rendezvous in the afternoon. Ah, they're doing a little bit of uh, bumping uglies, are they? Toss Charlie's bedroom. Okay. Well, Charlie's but the quickest way to Charlie's bedroom is this way, I guess. Oh, but it's blocked. Gonna have to go the long way around anyway. Yum. Whoa! <gasps> no one saw that. Back in the building. Don't know what you're referring to. <laughs> in and out real quick there. So, pick up the health. I don't know why I'd need that. No reason. Okay, 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 okay. Back here. Let's pick up that, let's pick up I'm that. Feeling just fine. Someone down there that was like dying to be kicked off the wall. Door here, there's a door. And the um, residiums up here. That's rolling. BIT. There was laughter in this morning's meeting. At you. Thus at me. Your voice is hilarious, apparently. Hmm. I have two options fire the staff again, or make you sound intelligent. So. Let's run through your speech process for the fifth time. A Charlie Montague game. A Charlie Montague game. That's good game design. <laughs> uh, can a game move you to tears? Can a game move you to tears? You stupid piece of Cobble together what you can from that. Remind me to add more later. Okay. Bravo, bravo. Your mind is overflowing with bountiful knowledge, stranger. So the Yerva is the, um, the quiz that I took earlier. The greatest secret of Queen of Riddles. My prodigious provenance. It's a game made by Charlie and voiced by Fia. 467 years ago to the day, my sisters and I appeared on this island by slipping through the cracks in reality after our cruel father chased us from our native kingdom of a thousand. Thomas. 
Graviton Workshop here. And the phrase Charlie Montague Restoration Project. Charlie Montague Restricting Precept. <sighs> Never mind, BIG will edit this out. What's this here? Letter from Wenji. Charlie asked Wenji to remove part of his brain in order to increase his computer's computational speed. Lol. Good morning, Charlie. Hear me when I say Black Reef loves you. You're the real badass. We need right now. Because of you, I will have a fulfilling day. And uh, he's been making a uh, two bit hey, edit little you um, You're like the best of us. little messages. Well, Charlie considered a very loud theme for his game. And what's this? A photograph of Freestad. Remember this. The afternoon's long shadows, frost ground beneath our souls, the scent of smoke and salt. Remember Freestad, remember us. Kiss, cuddle, kiss, cuddle, fear. Fear reminiscent okay, of a chilly ass afternoon. Like so, my next mission then, if I want to carry on working out how to uh, kill Charlie and Fear, is to go to Fristad Rock. I want your brain in my brain. Sounds sexy. Sounds sexy. How do I get out of this stupid game? Oh, fuck. Whoa, where did they all come from? Oh, are these all... <gasps> Beep! That was a Nexus. Hurt quite badly there, but I'm okay for now. Just need to make it to an exit before Juliana can get me. Look at those fucking nerds. Grown adults running around pretending to be monsters and wizards. Hee <laughs> hee! <laughs> Double kick! That's the first time I've ever done that. You witnessed some magic there, friends. Oh. Noit, noit. Um. 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 Let's get the fuck out of here. Where am I? How am I? Get the fuck out of here! Yeah! Excellent timing from me there, because it's 8 o'clock now, so that seems like a good place to leave it. Um, while I'm uh, doing the outro, let me know in the comments if you want me to see me do more of this. I can certainly do some more of this next week if you want to see more of the story, can't do it tomorrow because it's PUBG community console chaos and we're going to get silly in PUBG. Um, as someone reliably informed, there has been a big update for the game, so do get it updated Charlie and, and uh, all that lot if you need to on your uh, respective console. And I will be uh, if I get in on inviting you all to the I Ian Higson's the Battlegrounds. Place. Once, uh, once I go live, about 6.30 p.m. tomorrow. Let's check out my loadout quickly. And uh, we're going to infuse some gear. Oh, I did infuse that gun. Oh, shit. Oh, well, never mind. Um, right, what do we want to infuse a new slab? There we go. 
So I keep them both now. That's me sorted. Uh, I'm gonna. Can I? Oh no, I don't. Uh, okay. Let's sacrifice that and that and that and that. Is that enough? Still not enough. Shite. Okay, let's uh, sacrifice that and that. I need 8,000. Let's sacrifice that one. Oh, one more. Okay, to drink it and infuse. There we go. Got the double jump for life. Nice. Cool. More please in, says people. Uh, please, sir, can we have some more? Sweet. Yep. I'm happy to do some more because I like this game. It's good fun. Um, it's it's very enjoyable. Um, Returnal for high speed. Death loop for low speed, says Nightcat. Yep. That's about right. Death loop or Returnal can only afford one. Death loop is easier to play. Um, but I think I like Returnal more. I think I was more into Returnal uh, in the end. I just there was something about Returnal that I really liked. But Deathloop is probably the easiest to get into, and um, the more like a traditional video game, even though it's quite weird and 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 um, bizarre at first. Uh, Returnal's kind of, yeah, Returnal's great. Makes awesome use of like the dual sense and everything like that, and um, sounds fucking incredible through a pair of these as well. If you can get Returnal for cheaper than seventy quid, I think, like, because I think it was on sale for seventy quid, which was a bit silly. I think that put a lot of people off, but um, I'd uh, I'd say probably maybe this, even though I did like Returnal more. Um, but yeah, thank you very much everybody for watching. Big thanks to Nightcat Gavin for keeping everyone safe from the naughty, naughty sex bots. Oh, we live in a future where there's sex bots. Cool. Um, thanks to everyone who renewed memberships or sent a super chat. A big thanks to everyone who just watched and chatted and had a good time with me. Uh, I'll be back tomorrow about 6.30pm with some PUBG. Better go and ask the sausages if anyone wants to play. Bye-bye.